We're here with Los Angeles City Controller elect Wendy Gruhl at Judy Chu's election night celebration for her historic campaign for Congress. Um, first council member, can you tell us, well, actually, controller elect, you're soon to switch jobs, but can you tell us a little bit about why you're supporting Judy Chu tonight? Well, Judy Chu is a demonstrated advocate for the people. She is someone um, who is going to go to Congress and make sure that she accomplishes a lot of issues of housing and health care and employment. Um, she has demonstrated her ability, I, I think, to be one of the, the best congressional members. And this is a seat uh, where Hilda Solis took on the establishment and was able to uh, get to Congress, and I think that's the same thing Judy Chu did today. Now, looking ahead for your race, first we want to congratulate you on your um, successful run and election for a city controller. Now, can you tell uh, folks who aren't familiar what the city controller of Los Angeles actually does? Well, the city controller is the fiscal watchdog for the city of Los Angeles to make sure that we're spending our money wisely and effectively, um, that we're, we're looking at how to do things better, um, and to make sure we pay our bills on time. But most importantly, it's really being the taxpayer's advocate. And so I'm excited about starting July 1st uh, to use that office and the bully pulpit and the auditing function on management fiscal audits um, to turn around the city and to look at how uh, we can get into uh, a position uh, where we're not having to, as we just did this week, potentially think about laying off employees and downsizing the city of Los Angeles. But I'm excited about it. I've enjoyed being a council member and looking forward to July 1st. Now, the nature of this job, as you mentioned, is one of a watchdog. So how... Um, Will that put you in a different position relative for relative when you look at your former colleagues? Well, I think, you know, we all understand, you know, when you're a city council member, you're working to provide for your district and to do a variety of things that are going to be with the city and with your colleagues. I plan on, as city controller, uh, working with my colleagues on ways in which we can change things. Will there be instances where we disagree, uh, where the information we provide will challenge some of the positions they took? It, it may be, uh, but that is the role of the city controller. I'll be an independent voice uh, for the city of Los Angeles. The city's probably going to face uh, somewhere around a half a billion dollar deficit next year. What are your thoughts on ways that we can bridge that awful gap? Well, we're going to have to, you know, uh, look to work with our unions to be able to have our pension system be solvent, uh, to be able to ensure um, that uh, we uh, look at zero-based budgeting, go back to the basics, um, and, uh, you know, uh, really pare down um, the operation um, of the city and some of the members that we have. But we want to do that in a, a humane way and looking at early retirements and other ways in which we can uh, preserve uh, people's jobs, uh, but at the same time not reduce services dramatically. So uh, it's going to take all of us to roll up our sleeves and get it done. Now you've been a, one of the most ardent and passionate supporters of instant runoff voting. Can you tell us why you support it? Well I think you know you see how many elections we are having here in the city of Los Angeles. Um, in the state of California we spend millions of dollars um, having to do that um, and I, I, I believe that instant runoff voting is an option and an opportunity for us uh, to reduce the cost and to give people a chance to, to vote not ten times a year which it feels like uh, but that one time and to get more people out there to vote uh, which is ultimately the goal we all should have is to get more people out to vote. Now, last question for you. What, um, you know, one, one thing that obviously we all are working on is to get instant runoff voting so people have to vote less. What is, in addition to that, what are things that we can do to get more folks to vote? Well, I think the, the important thing is, you know, for them to understand that their vote makes a difference and for them to have a, a better understanding that we are going to work with the voters, that what is passed by them will actually be implemented, um, and for them not to be cynical about their elected officials. That's about transparency, it's about involvement and participation, um, and it's incumbent upon all of us to do that. Uh, thank you. Thank Los you Angeles City Controller-elect Wendy Grove.